Where we need to make a side seam on a 2 meter or 4 meter roll, unroll the two pieces ensuring the pile runs in the same direction. Fold over each piece approximately 300 millimeters or 12 inches in old money. To ensure a perfect seam, always cut a minimum of three rows of tufts, taking care not to trim any tufts off the pile as this will result in a poor seam. You will note that the grass pile runs down the length and to one side of the roll. Here you can see the tufts run over the roll edge and on the opposite side the pile runs away from the roll edge. Here we can see that the blade has penetrated the backing too far resulting in trimmed tufts. This will produce a poor seam. Recut before proceeding. Now unroll the joining tape down the centre line of the join, ensuring the shiny side is down and the blotting side is up. Fix at either end with a nail or adhesive. Now fold over the grass onto the tape and bring together ensuring the seam has a 2 to 3 mm gap. Too tight or too much of a gap will result in a poor seam. Fold over the grass where the pile runs over the edge of the seam. Using a mastic gun, apply a bead of adhesive just under the edge of the first section of grass, followed by a second bead of adhesive to the front edge to accommodate the second section of grass. Now, with an assistant, we can bring the seam together. It is very important to ensure no tufts are buried during this process. Once completed, lightly pressurise the seam to disperse adhesive and then nail seams every half a metre to ensure the seam does not part whilst the install proceeds. The nails can remain in position. For more information on installing artificial turf, please see www.artificialturf.co.uk